everybody, so today I'm going to show you two different looks but the looks are the same but with a different lipstick just to show you the different shades that you could choose for this look and let me know which lipstick look you think I should wear tomorrow for my Christmas party. I've used lots of products for the first time as well today so I really hope you enjoy them. So let's jump right in. So my mic wasn't on so I do apologise there's a voiceover for just a part of this but I'm using the Charlotte Tilbury Magic foundation in shade 6 and I am just sponging this into the skin and this foundation is a different colour to my neck but I am going to blend it in it's because I've had tan on and it has all come off my face and then I'm going to go in with the Maybelline eraser eye and this is going to come underneath the eye in the usual triangular shape and then coming around the nose just in the shadow of the cheek there and on the chin and blending that in and I'm also going to use this today just in the centre of the forehead here and I'm just going to come down the centre of the nose as a highlight then I'm going to give that a quick powder using the Collection 2000 powder and this is in Candlelight I'm also setting underneath the eyes with this and then contouring with my Fave Laguna Bronzer in all the usual places through the temples, the head, the cheekbone and down the jawline and of course just sculpting out the nose I'm still using Tom Ford Love Lust because I absolutely love this colour at the moment and I think that it just goes with everything. Today I'm going to highlight using the Soap and Glory Hocus Pocus Illuminizer and I'm taking this on my finger on my cheekbone I'm just going to tap that in and I'm just going to stop in line with my pupil so I don't come down too far and then I'm going to spread that out so I don't get any harsh lines and then I'm going to take what is left just onto the tip of my nose down the centre of my nose and on my cupid's bow and on the brow bone and just above it too and I finally got it delivered today it's back in my life it's Brow Wiz in Soft Brown so I'm just doing some fine lines at the front of the brow a clean line underneath and also on top and I'm just brushing through the front so that it's not so harsh and then setting that in place quickly using Maybelline Brow Drama. For the eyes then today I'm going to use my Tarte Lip Palette and this is called the Amazonian Clay Matte Palette. And these have got some really lovely colours in them. I'm going to be going for, for more of the purpley colours today. I feel like it's quite unusual to go for a look that's not a shimmery look at Christmas time. But I'm first taking the colour Best Friend. And I'm going to apply this across the lid. I'm not going to pack the colour on too much because I'm going to blend that out so it's a little bit lighter. I'm really going to use the fluffiness of the brush now just to blend this through. I'm taking that same colour then just on a round fluffy brush and I'm just going to go underneath the eye and I'm going to take this all the way across and I'm actually coming quite far down with this, what I think is quite far down anyway I'm going right over the part where your eyeball sort of ends so here if I pushed here this is where my natural socket is so I'm just going to go right up to that point I'm then going to take a smaller fluffy brush and I'm going in with Bombshell which is a deeper colour purple and this colour is going to go into the crease so I'm going to apply it straight into the crease here I'm not going to come down again, I'm going to create that lifted look and come about two thirds across as I always do I just find that this look looks better on me, my eye doesn't look as closed in I'm bringing that up and making sure that I leave that space for the highlight again and I'm just going to blend that out and then taking that same colour underneath the eye and this is going to go a little bit closer to the lashes I'm then going in with Super Mom which is right here and it's quite a light shade and I'm going to use this right at the front of the eyes here going just underneath on the lower lash line and above too I'm just going to blend that in as well 
And I'm also going to take just a little bit of that underneath the brow just to give it a little lift. I'm now going to do the lower waterline using the Charlotte Tilbury Eye Cheat. I think I'm going to go back in with Fashionista, which is the black, just underneath the lash line. I'm just going to press this into the outer part here and then smoke that out with my fingers. And then going on to the L'Oreal Super Liner in black, and I'm going to start quite thin at the beginning and gradually get thicker into a small cat flick. And then I'm going to go in with lashings of mascara today. I'm going to use Benefit Roller Lash. And then on top of that, I'm going to apply the Kiss Iconic Lashes. And I like these lashes because they're a little bit softer looking. I find that with the softer looking lashes, they just tend to blend in the natural lashes a little bit more. I don't know. I mean, they do anyway. And for the final part of the look, I'm going in with a new Charlotte Tilbury lipstick. I am in love with Charlotte Tilbury lipstick at the moment, as you can probably tell. But this is called Glastonbury, and it's quite dark for me. It's like a purpley colour, almost black, I would say. So I don't have a lip liner to match this, so I'm going to apply this very slowly. And now I'm going to try this with the second lipstick, it's just to show you that the purple eyes just matches with both of these. So the second lipstick is called Love Liberty. And that is the finished look. I actually think I prefer the darker lipstick, which is very unlike me, to this one, although I do love the colour, but I think it just matches the eyes a little bit better. I'm really impressed with this foundation at the moment. This is not a sponsored video either. I'm just really into Charlotte Tilbury at the moment. And I would say that it is quite similar to the foundation that I used in my last video as well in terms of coverage. This is just a demi-matte, so it's got a little bit more of a shine to it. But let me know which lipstick was your favourite and I really hope you enjoyed this look. Don't forget to leave me a comment below and thumbs up and subscribe for more videos. I'm posting three every week up until Christmas. But thank you so much everybody for watching and I'll speak to you all soon. Bye!